hey failure failure it's not a thing it's not a thing at all failure does not exist except and i'll tell you in a minute okay after no no no, no before we start all of that how you doing how you doing how you doing how you doing yeah. hey, 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 hey. hello 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 this is rosemary lonnie knight and in case it's short but this is the deliberate life stream how are you guys doing how are you all doing how are you all doing how are you doing well the affirmation for today is i am a winning machine i win 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 and so on and on it goes <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is the thing. Failure is not a thing. Failure is not actually a thing. It doesn't exist. You do believe maybe that it does, and that holds you back from taking action. Failure is, listen, okay, now, if you get your beliefs right around all of this stuff, you'll realize, one, that everything is working out for your good. So whatever situation you think you're in right now, that means that you are likely to fail or that you failed or whatever it's not true you're alive you're kicking as long as you do not give up then guess what it's not actually failure you are literally in the process of winning you're in the process of succeeding because actually you're a success machine you are created in the image of the divine you're created you're you're created in his likeness there is no way for you to fail except if you believe it is possible for you to fail. Now, for a lot of people, they do believe that it's possible for them to fail, so they don't even begin. That might be you. You might not even be beginning because you're worried of failing. Let's sing this affirmation before I carry on. <sighs> Take a deep breath with me. I am a winning machine. I win, I win. I win. I am a winning machine. I win. I win. I win. And again, I am a winning machine. I win. I win. I win. I am a winning machine. I win, I win, I win. Okay, so that is the affirmation for today. I do want you to take it on to it on for the rest of the day and in fact the weekend as well. But I need you to understand that you are in fact a success machine, you're a winning machine. Everything you do, everything that you're part of, everything that you especially when you are committed to the path of your calling, committed to the path of your purpose, there is no way for you to fail. The truth of the matter is this. You will even win at doing something you're not actually born to do if you set your mind like flint to make it work. The thing for most people is that they quit. They quit, they quit, they quit. They quit far too soon. And because they quit far too soon, they do not realize and they think failure then is a possibility. People have asked, yeah, but how do you know when it's time to stop? Or whatever? It's never time to stop. It's never, ever time to stop. You're alive, aren't you? It's never time to stop. You have to, go, to commit to the internal work of building that belief over and over and over again until you realize the, the vision or you die. <laughs> like there is no other option. You realize what it is that you're seeking to get or you die. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. There is no other option. Why? Because again, you are creating the image of the divine. You are more powerful than you think you are. There is no way of you failing. Literally, once you decide that something is going to work and then you stick with that decision, you can bring it to life. Again, the problem is that most people don't because they quit. They listen to people around them maybe saying, yeah, but isn't it time you just tried something different? Isn't it time you, get, you maybe you rethought your plan? And then maybe as you're staying on the journey, you might change direction a little bit here, then everywhere as you're following that internal guidance inside of you. But again, you don't, you never have to quit and you ne none of that is failure. It's only failure, yes, when you take yourself completely off the path, you stop listening to guidance and you choose to believe that the thing that you desire is beyond you. It isn't. If you are given a vision, it's yours to create. 
It's just whether you choose to or not. You are the only thing that gets to decide whether it comes to life or not. Spirit will not enforce your hand. You know, you've been given that vision. That is the word. Okay, that is the word. The promise has been given to you. Your vision is your permission. The question is, do you choose to go after it or do you choose to tell yourself it's impossible? And if you choose to tell yourself impossible, it's impossible, you will be a winning machine at not actually making it happen. Because again, you get what you want, which is not for it to work because you've told yourself that it's impossible. And so you get that it's impossible. But what if you decided to build belief and to continue building belief until you crossed over to the other side? What if you just refuse to see any other path, any other goal? Yeah, your path may change. But you refuse to, to settle for any less than the big vision for your life. And you know that, the whole, that everything is working out for your good. There is no such thing as failure. You are a winning machine if you will allow yourself to win. But you are the only thing that gets to determine this. You are the only thing that gets to determine this. You sometimes look at these seeming mountains in your life. And you think that, oh, it's a mountain and cannot be moved. It's a lie. You are a, a more powerful mountain than any mountain that tries to get in front of you. But will you choose to stay on path until the end? Let's sing this affirmation again. I am a winning machine. I win, I win, I win. And again. I am a winning machine. I win, I win, I win. This is the affirmation. So this is the thing. Belief, what you choose to believe in is your choice. Failure is impossible unless you choose to believe in failure, okay? If you choose to believe in failure, which doesn't take much building of belief because lots of people helped, have helped you build that belief since you were born, okay? So believing that you are a winning machine and that the thing that you are here to create can be created by you and staying on track until that thing is created, regardless of seeming um, uh, obstacles or blocks in your path, that takes building a belief in the in the, the in the, what's the word, what is the word, in the inevitability of your success, okay? The inevitability of your success, because success, honey, is inevitable. Success is inevitable. But you need to build enough belief in that to keep you on the path until you get there. Because, yeah, sometimes it will feel as if you went through a valley, the valley of the shadow of death, man. <laughs> And you'll be tempted to think, and there'll be lots of people helping you out to think, maybe you should come off the path. But you get to build enough belief that you stay on the path. And so this is it, guys. I invite you to join me for Building Belief, which starts on Monday, okay? It is for this kind of a reason that I'm putting this together, because sometimes we spiritual people seem to think that belief and faith and all of that stuff is just supposed to just happen. You do have belief and you do have faith, but usually in the wrong stuff, okay? And so if you look at your life right now and it's not quite looking the way you would like it to, it's because you have faith in the wrong stuff. That's why, okay? But I am asking you now to get very deliberate about belief, building belief in the right stuff so that you are able to stop looking at obstacles and, and thinking that that somehow is the end. No, it's not. Or not even starting. Some of you all haven't even started yet. You started doing the thing you really want to do because you're telling yourself it's impossible. It's not. Okay. Ooh, my mom is calling my daughter right now. To... <laughs> it's her birthday today. And yeah, anyway, I have to call my mom back. But anyway, so this is it. I'm going to bring this to a close. Join Building Belief right now. Okay. Because we're starting on Monday, or unless you're listening to this afterwards, in which case we'll start whenever you join in. And you will learn simple strategies that you can get very deliberate about building belief in your success rather than continually allowing your belief in failure to stop you from doing the thing that you're here to do. So pop over to rosemaynonenight.com forward slash building belief. Go join in. It is time for you to claim the life that you're here to, to build. OK, you know you're here to make a difference in a bigger, bolder way. You know you're here to make the world more beautiful, more caring, more loving place, but you're not showing up because you don't quite believe yet that you will not fail. I'm telling you right now, if you will commit and if you will build belief in the right stuff, you will not fail. Okay, there is no such thing as failure to us. So until the next time, honeys, go over to rosemaryonunite.com forward slash building belief, join in, click the button, read the page, click the button, go over to PayPal or wherever, 
I join right in. It's time. Until the next time, my honey, is much amazing love. <laughs>